Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart Six Quart High Pressure Multi Cooker. It's unique for several reasons, but the first is it goes up to 15 psi, where other products on the market go between 11 and 13. So it works more efficiently and faster. Um, when you're using pressure cookers, it cooks your food about 70% faster than conventional methods. The other thing that's unique about this product is that the way the lid operates. So um, oftentimes consumers have difficulty putting the lid on pressure cookers, but we've solved that problem for you. When you twist this knob in the top, you'll notice that the lid is um, visually shows you that it's not closed so that you know when your pressure cooker is open like this or closed so that the design is actually completely integrated. So that's a really great feature. I'm going to open it up and show you a few other things. So inside here you'll notice this is your sealing gasket. This actually, this whole piece comes off, you just pull on it and it can either be washed by hand, the seal is removable. So it can be washed by hand or you can actually put it uh, directly in your dishwasher in the top rack. So you also notice here that it says, um, whoops, <laughs> it says this side out. That's telling you how you should mount it back in the top of the pressure cooker. So pop that back in place and you're all set. Inside you also have your rack. This is great for steaming or doing desserts like custard. So you'll use that for that. This is your removable pot. Um, you can cook up to 16 cups of food, that's the maximum, and you should never operate your pressure cooker with less than, I believe, um, a half a cup of liquid. So the other thing that's really great about this um, multi-cooker is that you notice there's no exposed um, pressure valve. And the reason that is is because it's under this cover here and there's no reason for you to be touching it or, or uh, using it in any way. Um, and that's why it's integrated because the steam will be released from there when you use it. So I'm going to turn this around this way a little bit so you can see. Now you notice when um, you're not actually using the uh, multi-cooker that you don't see any of the pre-programmed functions, but the minute you actually touch the start stop button, they appear to you. And that's really great too, because um, if you're more interested in the way your products look on your countertop, you don't have to actually look at all the pre-programmed functionality unless you're actually using the product. So you'll notice there's um, 12 uh, pre-programmed functions. Um, meat is the first, so I'm just gonna show you, um, you would press that by choosing meat. And then here, if you wanted to, the buttons that are blinking, time and um, temperature slash pressure, you'll be able to um, adjust them if you want. If not, you can actually just use the pre-programmed functionality, which is meet and the pressure set on high. So you could just go like that and you just press start and it'll start. And here where you see where it says preheat, when it's preheating, it'll actually, those bars will increase until it's totally preheated. And then what will happen is it'll begin um, counting down once it comes up to pressure. And it works in reverse too. When you're actually done cooking and it's starting to release the pressure naturally, the bars will decrease until the pressure is completely released. So I'm gonna, you can just hold the button down, um, start stop button down for about two seconds and it'll go back to the main home screen. So the other functions are, um, besides meat, are uh, stews and chili soups, stocks, beans, because a lot of people love to cook beans from scratch because it's really fast um, thing to do in your um, multi-cooker. You have rice and grains, risotto, slow cook, custom, steam, reduce, and then saute brown. So the other thing I just want to show you too is, um, we're going to just pick meat again, and then I'm going to show you how to adjust the pressure level. So you can put it on high plus, which is the highest setting, that's 15 PSI. You can do high, whoops, low, high, and high plus. And so as you roll over those, then what you would do is you would actually press the button in the middle again, and that actually picks the functionality for you. So let's go back to the home screen. I'm going to hold this down and talk about a few of the other functions. So you have um, slow cook, um, reduce, and brown saute. Those are functionalities that are not using pressure. So, 
I just want to mention a few other things which are the exterior of the unit is stainless steel. Um, it has a really great knob on top with a little stainless steel insert. So here you'll notice you have your steam release button. The steam release is perfect for if you want to release the steam immediately upon finished cooking because some recipes call for natural release and some call for immediate release. If you want to use immediate release, all you do is you press this button and what's going to happen is automatically the steam is going to come out of the vents in the back. So um, that's really, really great um, function. You don't have to wait for that reason. And the other thing I want to show you, Tim, is going to turn the unit around a little bit. And you'll notice here, there's a little catcher, a small reservoir. And that is just, um, it's just to catch any condensation that might develop. And just remember to remove it and also um, clean it. You can throw it in the top rack of the dishwasher also. Not a problem. It's really convenient and easy to use. So there you have it, the six-quart high-pressure Cuisinart multi-cooker.